Manta Aircraft Company has revealed their unique vertical takeoff plane, the AN-2. What sets it apart from similar machines is its special engine system. It has eight fan-like engines on each side of the plane's body. These fans make strong thrusts and can push the plane down or lift it up, allowing it to take off and land vertically. The AN-2 uses a mix of electricity and fuel power. It has a special kind of engine called a gas turbine that makes electricity. Because of this, the airplane can carry more weight and fly longer distances than similar planes. This two-seater passenger plane is designed for private flights and carrying goods. It's made for situations where you need to take off and land straight up and down. The AN-2 can even take off from your backyard and zip you to any part of the city at speeds up to 300 km per hour. The company plans to make a version of the plane that can carry up to 5 passengers, so soon you'll be able to travel with your whole family. The engineers at 5B Company have come up with a new way to design and build solar farms. The 5B Maverick is an innovative unfolding technology. The solar panel looks like an accordion and is made in advance at a factory. Because these solar panels can unfold, a small team can install them in less than an hour anywhere on Earth. Each solar panel can produce up to 50 kilowatts of power just as good as the regular ones or even better. By making solar energy installation faster, cheaper and safer, 5B is working to speed up the availability of large amounts of solar energy. Up until now, the company has successfully put this technology in place at over 140 sites around the world. Together, these sites make up more than 70 megawatts of power. And in the future, this number will only go up. Yemeni engineer Hashem al Gaili has shown what a huge flying hotel of the future could look like, one that could stay in the sky for years. Named Sky Cruise, it's incredibly big and designed to hold about 5,000 guests. Inside, there are fun things like movie theaters, pools, spa salons, and even shopping centers. According to the designer, both goods and guests would be brought to the hotel using regular planes and private aircraft. Al Gaili's idea is for Sky Cruise to run on clear nuclear fusion energy, a technology that doesn't exist yet, but experts think will be invented very soon. The engineer says making this concept a reality is just a matter of time. However, because it's so gigantic, it will need new infrastructure and adjustments from the aviation industry. Still, the idea looks really cool, don't you think? We have no idea what category to put the splotch transformer in when it comes to transportation. It's like a hybrid electric two-wheeled vehicle that's not just for one type of use, but also lets the owner easily modify it. This device looks like a mix between an electric two-wheeled motorcycle with footrests, but with smaller wheels like an electric scooter. Riders can choose between road and off-road tires depending on the kind of ride they want. Both wheels have hydraulic and spring suspension, making the ride smooth and stable. The transformer gets its power from a motor with a peak output of 960 watts. This motor can go as fast as 38 km per hour in sport mode, but you can also choose lower modes like eco, middle, and high. The battery can take you up to 40 km on a single charge, which is enough for an exciting journey. The price of the Splotch Transformer is only $1,100, making it even cheaper than most electric bicycles. The Emirates Team New Zealand has set a new world record for land speed using a groundbreaking wind-powered land vessel. This invention is called Horonuku, and it's the fastest land vessel propelled by wind power. Its unusual aerodynamic shape works just like windsurfing. 
the wind blows into a huge multimeter sail, propelling the vessel to high speeds. The vessel itself is made up of two parts, the pilot's cabin and a counterweight with a wheel. Both parts are positioned at a distance from each other, which allows Horonuku to remain stable even in strong winds. Thanks to this, the Emirates Team New Zealand managed to reach a speed of 222.43 km per hour. Additionally, the Horonuku pilot claims that there's no top speed for the vehicle. It all depends on the weather conditions. Here's an invention that will surely amaze you. American artist Philip K. Smith took an abandoned cabin in the California desert and turned it into a stunning optical illusion called Lucid Stead. The artist took a cabin that had been slowly decaying in the harsh desert conditions for 70 years, added mirrors between the weathered wooden planks, and created the illusion that you could see through the building. You can notice the effect by slowing down and aligning yourself with the desert. The building's door and windows are equipped with color-changing LEDs. After darkness falls, they transform into bright rectangles that illuminate the desert. During the day, the surrounding landscape is reflected in the mirrors, making the cabin barely visible. Remote-controlled toy cars can also be astonishing. For example, a jet-powered model. YouTuber James Holmesley created a DIY remote-controlled jet-powered car called Project Air. This tiny version mimics full-size jet-powered cars, and believe it or not, it can go as fast as the real thing. Resembling a spacecraft, this little car is equipped with a JetCat 220 engine capable of producing 220 newtons of thrust. In its early runs, it reached speeds of 112 km per hour, but the goal was to push it to 150 km per hour to break the standing Guinness World Record. And guess what? James did it. He managed to set a new speed record at over 152 km per hour. However, after a few more attempts, strong crosswinds played a role, causing the car to break apart and the engine to be destroyed. If you've ever dreamed of riding a bike on water, the Hydrofoiler SL3 might just be the kind of transportation you're looking for. This device was created by the company Manta 5 based on the notion that traditional watercraft like jet skis are bulky and require a lot of effort to transport and store. The Hydrofoiler SL3 is like an underwater bicycle and operates similarly to an electric bike with pedals. Manta 5 claims that it's incredibly easy to ride. Newcomers can learn to handle the SL3 in just 40 minutes thanks to its user-friendly design. Additionally, it's easy to assemble and disassemble, making it convenient to transport in a car to the beach or a water park. Sirocco, a company, has created a high-tech speed sailcraft that has broken a world record. The swift vessel named Moonshot is designed to break the world speed record for emissions-free water travel. It looks like a capsule suspended a few feet above the water surface. It would be almost like a flying boat if not for an extendable lever attached to an underwater wing, providing stability, direction, and the only point of contact with the water. By flying above the water surface, Moonshot reduces friction allowing it to reach speeds up to 150 km per hour. Two people inside the capsule will have a task of controlling the kite and wing for optimal balance and movement. Quite a challenge when moving at such speeds. Currently, the team is working on economically and ecologically sustainable ideas for maritime transportation systems. With this unusual chair, you can now stay cool during the hot weather. Icy water is pumped through your chair thanks to the Ecto system. Ecto is available as a full chair or as a cushion that you can add to your existing seat. 
In both cases, a built-in pump draws icy water from your cooler and continuously circulates it through a 54-foot-long thermal tube in the seat. With a single button control unit, users can choose between three cooling levels, which maintain the seat temperature at 18, 13, or 7 degrees Celsius. A single charge of the built-in 5,000 mAh Ecto battery should last 9 hours of use at the highest cooling level, and up to 36 hours at the lowest level. The Ecto chair features a cushioned seat and armrests, so you can definitely relax on it with comfort. How do you like these inventions? If you enjoyed them, give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. On a final note, we'd like to mention that this is just a glimpse of what we have in store for you. So stay tuned and you'll always be up to date with the latest technological developments.